I accidentally found Google's list of bad words which are not allowed to be used in programming code. I was watching a video about WebGPU, which is an interface that is designed to make cross-platform development easier, specifically talking about graphics. And as part of the research, I obviously took a look at some of the implementations. For example, WGPU. Then the video also mentions Dawn, which is an open source cross-platform implementation of the WebGPU standard made by Google. That sounded very interesting, so I decided to take a look by cloning the repository. And then by total accident, I found this pre-submit Python file, which looked very interesting to me, so I had to take a look. And this is where I found the list of non-inclusive regexes. For those of you who are wondering what that is, this is basically a list of words or partial words that can be completed with a bunch of characters in front and at the end or maybe in the middle, where Google says, okay, well, if part of this word is somewhere found in a text, I want to toss out a warning. In this case, however, the text that they are looking at is not a public text, it is their source code. Naturally, we had a discussion about it on stream. Pre-submit Python file? Why do you have a Python file in a library like this? A pre-submit Python file? She, he? Grandfather? Black, white? What is this? Slave, master? Oh my god! Before committing, it's think it's looking at all of these. It's a file to remove racism. <laughs> oh my god! What is that supposed to mean? To mean greatly? First class citizen. <laughs> oh my god. Gray hat, gray list. Hä? Hey. Uh, by the way, uh, the backslash B, what is that again? Is it supposed to be that exactly? Word boundary, so him, his, she, her, guys, hers, man, woman, she, she, he. The exact term, woman, is not supposed to be in the repository. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, grandfather? What's wrong about that? What's wrong about grandpa? Crazy? <laughs> I am seeing something right now. Holy shit. Oh my god. These imaginary problems. Yeah. Goodness. Blind? Oh my god. I think this is racist. You can't say the word blind? But it exists. Yeah, that's dumb. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> that's racist, bruh. Can't say dummy. Guess you can't work for Google anymore. Yeah. Sorry, what is this part of? This is part of a library? that is supposed to be for web development or um, we we were talking about web gpu earlier which is like an interface that allows you to use that interface and then uh, program your or use your program cross-platform like on the web and natively on your computer uh, you know windows linux mac all of that uh, that is the idea and this is an implementation of that idea so basically they gave a header file they define a header file and this we call it they call it dawn is an implementation of that header file and as part of that implementation the code they have a non-inclusive non regex list where they exclude certain words from the code so you cannot have grandfather in your code. Because that's racist. <laughs> Bob said woman, I'm calling the HR department. Yeah. <laughs> but you can have grandmother racist. True. I need to add that. Wait. But we want to be equals here, right? We should do a push request now. Or is it a pull request? Sexist, not racist. That's sexist. Yeah, we need grandmother too. Grandfathering is a common term in programming. A oh, fike. What does grandfathering and programming mean? I've never heard that. What about aunts? <laughs> I don't know. Lint filters. 
Check non-inclusive language. Checks the files for non-inclusive language. Affected files. For every affected file, if the regex is in the list, match the regex. Found non-inclusive language. Uh oh, non-inclusive language found. What then? What happens? Oh, so they just found it and they are outputting it as a warning. Run it on your code cakes, run it on your code cakes, run it on your code cakes. Now I have to say, I found this list very interesting and worrying, I guess, at the same time. Because words like dummy or dumb are not supposed to be in there. I'm pretty sure a big part of it is social pressure. But yeah, some of these words are really dumb. And by the way, uh, penis is not part of it, which uh, I find interesting. Anyways, just wanted to talk about it. Hope you all have a great day and I'll see you all next time. Peace.